profit, you need healthy plants. And to grow healthy plants, you need good levels of nutrients, soil organisms, water, and sunshine. Of course, all plants, healthy or not, need nutrients. In a natural setting, bacteria refine nutrients from the smallest component of soil, clay particles, and from humus, which is made of decaying organic matter. Nutrients are concentrated where bacteria live and are often taken up by the plant directly, while others are transported to the roots by activities of larger organisms like nematodes and fungi. With this network of supporting life forms, plants maintain the nutrient levels they need to grow. When the plant dies, most of these nutrients are returned to the soil and become the nutritional foundation for the next plant that grows there. On the other hand, farming requires the crop to be removed and along with it, so are many nutrients. Since plants need nutrients and with harvesting, the soil inevitably becomes depleted. Farmers are required to apply fertilizer. Typically, NPK fertilizer blends are used since these three are by far the largest component of soil nutrients found in plants. Unfortunately, high concentration of these fertilizers can drastically reduce the population levels of the soil organisms that help supply these and other nutrients to the plant. Another challenge is that different geographic regions have varying pH levels, restricting the type of crops that may be successfully grown. So, when trace elements need replacing, and adding fertilizer to the soil is detrimental to them being absorbed, or when the soil's pH restricts nutrient availability, how then can we get all the nutrients into the plant? Plants need a balance of many different nutrients to grow. With favorable growing conditions, these macro and micronutrients influence plant size and health, determine a plant's susceptibility to disease and pests, and control the quantity and quality of the yield. All plant nutrients come from one of two places, the air and the soil. The bulk of the soil originating nutrients are referred to as macronutrients and are common fertilizers. Although micronutrients are needed in very small amounts, they are nonetheless essential to plants and provide much needed benefits. When there is a deficiency or excess of one or more nutrients, the health of the entire plant suffers. The leaky barrel theory clearly shows the need for all plant nutrients in proper proportions.